hello friends welcome to my channel in this video we are going to see new job recruitment from cgcl the published recruitment notifications for the post of apprenticeship around 1166 vacancies and all the details regarding these posts are discussing in this video so please watch the video till the end without skipping and if you are new to my channel please do subscribe my channel also so let's check all the re details regarding this post power grid corporations of india limited has published recruitment notifications for the post of graduate engineering diploma it and hr executive apprenticeship and pgcl has published these recruitment notifications region wise and vacancies are available in almost all the indian states where pgcl has its presence all the relevant details regarding these posts are discussing here First of all, notification details, organization name, Power Grid Corporations of India Limited, recruitment exam name, PGCL recruitment 2022 4166 apprenticeship job vacancies and post notified graduate diploma, ITA and HR executive apprenticeship and its recruitment type comes under apprenticeship in PGCL. Stipend or salary details for this job is PGCL is offering a monthly stipend or salary from 11,000 to 15,000 during apprenticeship visit and also payment of additional rupees 2,500 per month in case no accommodation is provided. And then next comes vacancy details that I already said 1,166. Then next comes eligibility criteria candidates processing engineering degree or diploma in relevant subject, ITA diploma bachelor's degree or PhD degree etc and then next comes age limit above 18 years then next comes selection process selection as engineering or graduate or diploma or IT or HR executive apprenticeship in PGCL will include shortlisting of candidates for apprenticeship in PGCL will be done based on the percentage of marks obtained in the qualified trade or engineering branch then shortlisted candidates for apprenticeship in pgcl shall be intimated through the registered email id and shortlisted candidates will have to appear for verification of documents and no ta or da will be paid for verification of documents to shortlisted candidates and on successful completion of document verification submission of medical certificate in prescribed format and execution of apprenticeship contract agreement letter of engagement as apprenticeship training in pgcl will be issued to the candidates then next comes application fee there is no fees to be paid is required to pay by the candidates and then next comes important dates starting date of online application is 7 7 2022 and last date is 31 7 2022 here shows the official notifications from power grid and in this uh, it is said that the starting date and uh, closing date for online application submission and also a job location is given for the state of haryana apprenticeship trade and corresponding uh, vacancy and category wise vacancy is also provided here then next comes training locations is also given then next comes eligibility criteria for the post of graduate electrical b or b tech or bsc engineering in electrical engineering stipend is 15000 and for graduate computer science b b or b tech or bsc in engineering computer science engineering or information technology here also stipend say for hr executive mba or postgraduate diploma in personal management or personal management and industry relation here also 15000 salary and then comes for executive post two year full time master in social work is required and stipend 15000 and how to apply will also provided here first the candidates should register in this uh, given portal after that applying for this post yeah. and one thing to be noted and you have to apply before the last date and here the job location is Karnataka and corresponding apprenticeship trade for diploma electrical civil 
then graduate electrical civil secretarial assistant csr executive executive law total vacancy 28 similarly category wise vacancy is also given here and then next comes for the state of tamil nadu same details are also given for kerala also detail is given here then eligibility criteria is also given for apprenticeship trade electrician qualification required is it in electrician trade stipend 11000 for diploma electrical full time diploma in electrical engineering 12000 stipend then for diploma civil same for graduate electrical civil salary 15000 and corresponding qualification required is also given and then next for the state andhra pradesh total vacancy 42 then next for telangana vacancy 32 and category wise vacancy is also given here here training locations in andhra pradesh and telangana is separately given corresponding trade corresponding qualifications and stipend provided is also given then next for the state of madhya pradesh vacancy 56 category wise vacancy is also given for corresponding trade then next for the state of gujarat vacancy 53 and then corresponding eligibility criteria for corresponding trade and stipend required is also given then next for maharashtra region total vacancy 58 category wise detail vacancy is also provided jo training locations for maharashtra chatisgarh Madhya Pradesh Goa is also given. Then qualification required for trade and corresponding salary details also given. Then next for the state Delhi vacancy toll category wise vacancy. Then next for Haryana Haryana here. vacancy 56 then for uttar pradesh vacancy 18 then next for rajasthan vacancy 43 and uttarakhand 13 vacancy then next training locations in delhi haryana rajasthan up and uttarakhand is also given and then next comes eligibility criteria corresponding to various trade and side stipend details then next comes odisha total vacancy 47 and training locations is also given then next comes eligibility criteria corresponding to various trade and stipend then next comes job locations for the state of arunachal pradesh total vacancy 30 and for the state of assam vacancy 50 then next for manipur vacancy 4 and meghalaya 20 and for mizoram 2 then next comes nagaland for vacancy and for tribura eight vacancy then next comes various trade and corresponding qualification required stipend provided then next for the state of west bengal vacancy 63 then for sikkim total vacancy eight then next training locations in west bengal and sikkim then correspond trade and corresponding qualifications and stipend job location bihar
54 vacancy then next comes jharkhand vacancy 20 then next training locations in bihar and jharkhand after that trade corresponding qualifications and stipend then next comes job location up 90 vacancy then uttarakhand vacancy 5 then training locations in up and uttarakhand then comes trade qualifications and stipend and finally for jammu and kashmir total vacancy 28 then for haryana region 13 vacancy and punjab punjab comes 22 vacancies and for himachal pradesh 15 vacancy and for chandigarh 2 vacancy and ladakh region 75 vacancy then corresponding training locations and after that trade and corresponding qualification required and stipend so industrial candidates can go through these detailed notifications for various state and after that you can apply for this post hope you all like my video and if you are like my video please like and share to your friends thanks for watching